Clinical Measurement SAQ5 ROC Curve A. What do you understand by sensitivity, specificity, positive predictive value and negative predictive value of a test? 6 marks. Sensitivity is the ability of a test to correctly identify a positive outcome where one truly exists. It is the number correctly identified as positive divided by total number that are actually positive. A divided by A plus C. Specificity is the ability of a test to correctly identify a negative outcome where one truly exists. It is the number correctly identified as negative divided by total number that are actually negative. D divided by D plus B. Positive predictive value is the certainty with which a positive test result correctly predicts a positive value. It is the number correctly identified as positive divided by total number with positive outcome. A divided by A plus B. Negative predictive value is the certainty with which a negative test result correctly predicts a negative value. It is the number correctly identified as negative divided by total number with negative outcome. D divided by C plus D. B. How can the sensitivity and specificity of two diagnostic tests be compared? 4 marks. The sensitivity and specificity of two tests can be compared by using a receiver operating characteristic curve, ROC curve. The ROC curve is a graphical representation of the ability of a test to predict an outcome. It shows the accuracy of a binary test. The y-axis is the true positive rate or sensitivity. The x-axis is the false positive rate or 1 minus specificity. A series of results is obtained as the discrimination threshold for the test is progressively altered. The area under the curve AUC is then calculated, which is a measure of the accuracy of the test. If AUC equals 1, this is a perfect test. If AUC equals 0 0.5, this is a useless test, which is represented by the dotted line. Different tests can be plotted on the same graph to enable comparisons, such as test A versus test B. The curve can then be used to select the best cutoff point to use clinically. The uppermost left point represents the best balance between sensitivity and specificity. In this graph, test A is more useful than test B.